Okay, welcome back. Here is Lucas, and I will explain how to install CDK uh, from GCP in your local machine. Okay, so let let's get started. Um, the first step is pull the image of of Docker in your local machine. This step is here and this output is different from that this because I I had the the that image okay later I run this command to get a version of the tools that that have this image okay all these are the tools we can use with this image. Later, okay, okay, I will go in a correlation with this. The second step is here, Docker run. The third step is this. I I try it to to log in to log it with this command but I can log in as you can see because this once time we we had logged in by 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 docker we we account will be saved in this container the cloud config so later anytime we need to use um, this 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 tool we don't need log again so if if the, the container is restarted or de deleted we we must but the idea is we don't need log anytime we need to to use that this tool okay and the fourth step is create an alias we can do that like this with this command I set CSDK like the the alias you can choose you can set any alias that you want later of this the fifth step we list all the projects with my 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 account with this command we can make this with the the, the alias csdk G cloud project list or with all this command <laughs> okay so i i recommend strongly you use an alias because it's more simple and easiest way to 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 make uh, the things. The sixth step, we prove the change of project. I set a variable like this project name uh, with this value. Okay. Uh, here I define it uh, in a wrong way so I redefine here like this and later I run this command to to set the project and we can see the project with this value of name doesn't exist so we don't we will don't set in that project because it does, doesn't exist 
and if we we can change of and a project that uh, of change of uh, a project that really exists like this and we can do that like this CSDK gcloud config set project and with the the name of, of the project and we will see in the output some like this and that's all this project is I filter like cloud project because we can use this by by any project no no specifically like a data project we can use this to to any other like C C I C D project um, AI project okay because that uh, for for that reason I put this this product in a new repository in my GitHub call it um, like cloud projects if I don't remember but so that is all and uh, see you later.